Dear learners, welcome back to MCQ, List Study Corner. I am your host Dr. Will Murun. This is List Keynotes for UGC Net, SET, JRF, KVS, TN Librarian and other competitive examinations based on the new syllabus 2021. Keynote 8, Unit 4, SET 8, Topic is NISOT. Last video we saw the keynotes about NISOT introduction, history of NISOT and NISOT programs and activities and finished with the information centers. Now let us continue with the other NISOT programs. Come let us go. NISOT other programs except information centers as I have already discussed in the last video and the other activities such as value added patent information systems VIPIS, national access Centers to International Data Services, NASITS, CD-ROM National Collection Center, Computers and ICTs based activities, Promotion of User of Standards, Information Technology Applications, Manpower Development in Information Science and Technology, International Activities and R&D in Information Science and Technology. Here value added patent information systems. NISAT established VAPIS in two areas to strengthen patent information activities in India. There, one is chemistry and chemical technology from National Chemical Laboratory, Pune, and Engineering Center Manufacturing Technology Institute, Bangalore. Value added patent information systems covers preparation of trend reports, forecasting, identifying technological alternatives, research areas, and business opportunities. National Access Centers to International Data Services, that is called NASITS. During 1980s and mid-1990s, NISOT established several NASITS to provide online access to remotely held international databases through online research service providers such as Dialog, STN, SDZ, etc. These centers were established in R&D institutions in metro cities like Delhi, Mumbai, Bangalore, Calcutta, Pune, etc. CD-ROM National Collection Center NISAT supported a national collection of CD-ROM databases on India and CD-ROM products produced in India. The center was set up at Foundation for Innovation and Technology Transfer it is called FITT in Indian Institute of Technology, Delhi in 1996. The center rendered services from CD-ROM collection the center has stopped functioning since 2003. Computers and ICTs based activities. NISAT supported the development of indigenous databases in science and technology areas. Databases of union catalogs for ratio sharing. Establishment of library networks like Delnet, Calibnet, Bonnet, PuneNet, Adinet, MyLibnet in Delhi, Kolkata, Mumbai, Pune, Ahmedabad, Mysore, respectively. NISAT supported library networks. ADINET host site is Informnet Gujarat University Campus Ahmedabad, managed by Society Drawn Support from Informnet. BONET National Center for Software Technology, Bombay, managed by Institutional Project. CalibNet Regional Computer Center, Jadavpur University Campus, Calcutta, managed by Society. DELNET India International Center, New Delhi, managed by Society Drone Support from IIC. MyLibNet, CFTRI Mysore, managed by Institutional Project. PuneNet, Bioinformatics Center, Pune University, Institutional Project. NISOT ICT based activities continue. Establishment of websites, servers such as Indian Ocean Server at NIO Goa, Indian Constancy website at CDC New Delhi, Vigion and Indian Science and Technology website, and Liz Forum is an email based discussion forum for list professionals in India, which was established in 1995 with support from NISOT, DSI, or Government of India. Liz Forum is operated and maintained by NCSI, Indian Institute of Science, Bangalore. Nisha Promotion of Use of Standards. NISOT takes active interest in the diffusion of standards of uh, library information activities. Its campaign supported with the training, help, CCF, it is called Common Communication Format, to earn the status of a de facto national standard for exchange of information, creation of databases, etc. NISOT Information Technology Applications 
Nisha talked about two software packages, namely CDS ISIS for bibliographical processing and a retrieval system, and IDMs for statistical data processing from UNESCO for distribution to Indian institutions. Further, Nisha subsequently obtained the official rights for distribution of the two packages in India. One is Sanjay, another one is Trishna. Nisha, in collaboration with Dizidag, developed the software package Sanjay to help the libraries and the information centers in India to provide and improve their housekeeping and service functions through automation. The package was released for marketing in September 1995. Trishna Nizat also developed another series ISIS based package is known as Trishna. The Trishna developed in collaboration with the National Institute of Science and Technology and Development Science Studies is in his dad's needle. He supports the use of serious ISIS using a GIST card for materials in Devanagari and several other Indian scripts. This package was distributed to ASINT for member countries like Nepal and Bangladesh. Manpower Development in Information Science and Technology. Nisot encouraged and supported several training programs in library and information fields such as application of computers in library and information centers, use of personal computers and CDS ISIS, TGM in library services, technical communication, cytomatics, CD-ROM and online searching etc. NISERT International Activities NISERT Advisory Committee functioning as National Advisory Committee of UNICEST and the National Advisory Group for ASINFO and UNESCO. NISERT contributed a section of South Asia in the World Information Report 1997. NISERT also conducted a cross-country analysis of information scenario in Asia and the Pacific countries to the study on information infrastructure for planning information systems and networks in Asia and the Pacific countries undertaken by UNESCO and the University of Library and Information Studies, Shukuba. NISAR R&D Information Science and Technology NISAR promoted and supported R&D activities and service studies in information science and technology, particularly in areas scientometric and informatic studies such as national mapping of science, Indian science through bibliometric indicators, industrial innovation indicators, etc. As a first step towards this, nine projects on national mapping of science using CD-ROM databases. Thanks for watching. Please hit the like button if you like it. Please subscribe to us if you are a new viewer. Please share this video to your friends to get benefit and please comment if you have any query and suggestions through my YouTube channel or my website. I below link. Thank you.